<sighs> Man, I'm tired. It's pretty early in the morning. I just finished doing some yoga, which I do every morning, by the way. But I was out a little bit late last night. Had a couple of... Not a smart idea. Okay. Got a package today. I know, this is, there's a lot of... I've been doing a lot of stuff videos and I want to stop doing that, but again, just timing of the fact that I'm going to be going on vacation soon. I have to, I'm buying some stuff that I need. That's heavy. It's pretty heavy. Wow. This is, uh, this is pretty big. RAV power, 26,800 milliamp hours. That's a lot. That's some serious uh, power there. So it has three, it has three USB ports. It can do up to five and a half amps, or each port can do 2.4 amps. So three, 2.4 amps, max five and a half amps. Uh, it's main China, right? So these are obviously not 18650 cells because they're too big. So this would be the um, the pouch type cells, like you have in a, in a in a cell phone, and I think I also got the power adapter. This is this is a little bit a little bit more expensive. You can get it without it, but I think this gives you quick charging. I probably didn't need to buy this to be honest, because I probably already have a charger that does output five volt, two point four amps. So not two point four amp charging, so it's not bad. All right, that's not really photography related. Well, in a way it is, I guess. Or video related, because I'll be able to charge my stuff. Uh, air pouch cells, all right. I bought, so I wanted a, I don't, don't have a tribal tripod. I just have this uh, big, well, I have a Manfrotto with a video head on it, so it's pretty serious. Don't want to bring that with me. Need something small and light. So I got this. I hope this is the right one. Hold on a second. Anyways, it's it's a it's an Amazon Basics. So I'm an Amazon Prime member. Uh, Amazon Basics means I don't know Amazon man gets this stuff manufactured for them and they label it. It's a 52 inch travel tripod, carbon fiber. Yeah, I opted for the carbon fiber one. Now it was only a hundred and it was a hundred and twenty eight dollars Canadian with taxes and everything. So there was a lot of good reviews on Amazon about it. I, I mean, can we really trust any reviews these days? I don't know, but I figure, hey, even if, even if it's a one-shot deal and it serves my purpose while I'm out there, it's actually pretty heavy. I thought it'd be lighter than this. It's 12 inches, 30 centimeters. It's it is carb it is carbon fiber, right? Okay. Uh, these things are freaking plastic. It's always got to be some sort of plastic. Shh. Okay. Okay, so there's a little clip here. It's plastic. You pull that out. You can, there's basically three, looks like there's three ways you can do this. So one's like that, and that stops there. And I guess one is like, one is like that, which stops there. So it's plastic, man. Because that's, that, these are, I mean, let's be honest, this, these tabs are the first things that are going to go, I think, so far by looking at it. At least it's got metal screws here. All right, so let's extend it. It twists is a new thing. I actually still kind of, I actually prefer the, the clip design, you know, with the little latches, like the, like my, my Manfrotto here. I don't know. It's, it's easy. It's, look, see how long it took me to do this? I could have had that Manfrotto undone a lot quicker. It's a travel tripod, so you're not looking for super superior stability. But let's just check out the head. And that locks. Oh, that extends pretty high actually. So it's 52 inches apparently. Which, that's 44? Yeah. Come on. Uh, it's actually 53 with the ball head. <clears throat> Ooh, it's removable. So I will be able to screw on my Siri head onto this. 
the ball head's okay. It actually is actually is really light. It's it's this it actually is really light. It's the ball head that that adds that extra weight, obviously. Oh, it's got a nice little release mechanism here to release the plate, so that's not too bad. Okay, so that's the ball tightening thing here. And this is the turning tightener. I don't know, it feels it feels pretty good. It also has a a hook. Cool. For extra stability. Bonus. Obviously it's gonna get knocked over at any winds over you know 20 kilometers an hour. You can add the bag for stability. You know what? I'm not a huge fan of the of the twists. It just takes longer. I don't know if they're just cheaper to, to produce or what. And, that, and, the, and the thing just fell off. I thought that was supposed to be held in by that. Don't you, don't you hate when something like that falls, falls off and you're like, oh, it's only got to be like, you know, five inches away. And it's, you know, 50 inches away. And you figure, how the hell did that happen? How did it go so far? Seriously. I can't find it. Oh, there it is. Comes with this bag, which is hey, you know what? It's a oh, it's got even a little, it's got even a little zipper pocket inside. Is that the manual? What is this? Oh, look, comes with a couple Allen keys to tighten. That's nice. Quick setup guide. I can put this underneath. So if you want to take a low angle shot, you could do one of those. I don't think I've ever done that before. When you guys comment and tell me to shut up about how much I don't like the twisty knob thing. Okay, we're done. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta get used to this. I gotta get used to this twisty stuff. I'm not used to it. There's a bag. It's cute. Sure. That is it for now. Enjoy. I'm gonna enjoy my banana smoothie.